In an earlier tutorial, I showed you how to use the transform each command to create some spirograph like effects. In this one, I'm going to show you how to use the rotate tool to create another spirograph inspired pattern. Go ahead and create some kind of shape. Let's just say the pen tool, and I'm just going to click and drag, create some kind of shape like so. So we just have a border, a stroke, blue, no fill. All right, with that selected, go ahead and click the rotate tool over here. Hold down Alt on the PC, Option on the Mac, and just left click there. And for angle, I'll just do 10, that's fine, and press copy. And then just press Control D, and it'll come up with this nice pattern here. So that's the first step. Sorry, we have some kind of radial pattern there. Now you can click and drag around all of it and repeat that select the rotate and let's just say right here and I'm gonna say 15 copy press control D a couple times that does get even another pattern alright a pattern of a pattern alright so you can do that with this one simple shape that I made or you can do of course like a polygon press the up or the down keys on the keyboard and you can come up with different beginning shapes. Rotate, and I'm going to alt click that corner there. And I'll just say 5 degrees, copy. When I press Control D or Command D on the Mac, basically it's just repeating. And there we go. There's that spirograph effect. Alright, so uh, you can use this with various shapes or with uh, custom shapes that you create with the pen tool. Just rotating and copying um, instead of the transform each command. Just another way to create that look that's inspired by a spirograph. Thanks.